Hi, this is Peter Kolak from realestateblackbook.com. Today I'm going to show you how you can list your property on MLS and Realtor.com for free. There's nothing illegal about it. It's totally legit. We're not stealing anybody's password. So uh, let's get right to it. The way you can get this link is by getting my realestateblackbook.com, which is going to be released next Tuesday on December 11th. Uh, let's go ahead and open up that ebook. I'm going to show you where this resource is at. This is the resource right here. It's on page 48 of my ebook. As you can see, there is 56 pages in total. So let's go ahead and click on that, and we'll go right to the website here. This is the front page of exishouse.com. This is uh, the website that I'm speaking about. It is exishouse.com right here. Uh, the way you have to go is you will get started right here and you're gonna have to go ahead and do a free registration with them just go ahead and register here and you will have to provide them with your first name last name main phone number this is for your listings contacts uh, if you want to be a seller or a seller and buyer it all depends how you want it to enter there your email address, make sure it's a valid email address because they'll be sending you a confirmation email that they'll need from you in order to access this website. Read the terms of use. They kind of explain in there uh, how they are able to make this thing happen for free. They have a sister website that they deal with. So go ahead and read that and click on here that you agree and hit the register button. I've already registered, so I'm not going to go ahead and do that again, and I'll see you and on the inside. Okay, once you register, you're going to receive a confirmation code in your email that looks just like this. You can use any email. I would suggest probably a free email address that you can use uh, in Yahoo or Gmail or Hotmail or anything like that. Uh, so you're going to have to go ahead and click on that link and you'll be taken to the confirmation page where you can be able to log in. Now this right here is the login page. You'll input your email address here and password and you can hit it right here so it remembers you on your computer if it's your home computer. Otherwise I wouldn't do that. And you go ahead and log in. Once you log in, this is the main page that you'll be able to see. Right now I have a dummy uh, listing that I created you're not going to see that you're going to have to start a new listing but you can go ahead and hit add property right here and you'll be able to use this exit wizard that's what I suggest since uh, you're new to the website it's step by step wizard that takes you through the whole entire process so go ahead and click on exit wizard and you are taken to this uh, page right here where you'll be going through different listings and different options right here and you'll be clicking these buttons down here once you fill out a uh, form that they're going to ask you so let's go ahead and click next and right here you're going to be choosing either a single family home condo or uh, any other ones now you notice that uh, land and mobile and multifamily are not part of the free MLS listing yet uh, they might do that in the future, I'm not sure. The listings that are free are single family and condo townhomes and they're only available in I think 20 some states or so. This map right here, which you can find it on their website as well, shows the websites that are covered under the free MLS listings. Those green ones are the ones that are allowed. So. Let's go ahead and keep going with this. Uh, you click a single family home. You have to create a uh, address here in Detroit, Michigan, 48212. Click next. And you'll just list your price. and you'll keep going down these options. I'm not going to go through this whole thing because it's pretty self-explanatory and it's going to take a while for me to do that. So I'll show you what the listing sort of ends up. So right here you can see the dummy listing that I've created. You can add it 
the property right here you can delete it you can view it unpublished uh, so those are your choices here it shows you how much the buyer agent commission will be as you can see it's zero right here uh, and you can check out the other tabs where you can search for different properties in your uh, state let's go in Detroit Michigan and see what we have here looks like there is right now there's 10 properties listed here which is not a lot but the good thing about this website it gets you into MLS where agents you know if you're trying to uh, sell a house especially during these times uh, you can have it as lease option or rent to own sometimes you know having it listed in MLS really helps you out because agents can you know buyers agents can find a house for their clients and they're from you so uh, let's keep going here now before I finish this presentation uh, I wanted to go over a few more things here here you, they'll show you sample properties let's go to advanced property here and see what it looks like uh, they have several different features in here that you can see you can put a picture on here that will change over as you hover over those pictures you can click additional features where you can specify each individual room you can put in videos photos um, you can go ahead and make an offer and you can actually email this property to somebody else so if you have a client calling you you can just go ahead and email this over to him and he'll get that you can he can see what the property looks like so this is basically all for today uh, as you can see this website is pretty straightforward it's pretty easy to navigate uh, and you'll get into MLS and Realtor.com and these are pretty big websites and they get a lot of traffic from Realtors and other people and you'll be able to have your house listed in there now stay tuned because on the next video I am going to show you how you can put your newspaper ads that you usually put in the paper and you pay for them uh, I don't know how much it is in your city but I know it's not cheap you can take those newspaper ads, pretty much same newspaper ads, and list them in my resources that I'll be providing you. One resource, uh, actually a few of them are free, and I have another resource where there is pretty much millions of people going to that website uh, on everyday basis, and you can get a listing on there for about $10. So stay tuned, and I'll be sending you another video in the next few days. Until then, Bye.